Hey you guys, welcome back to another Vlogmas video. Today's video is going to be real short as I am going to go over my Christmas playlist, but I will leave all the songs in the description box below for you guys to check out. But I wanted to just give you a rundown of what they are in case you are curious. As you may recall, the whole reason I decided to do Vlogmas was for you guys to get to know me a little bit better. So I thought, what better way than to share my Christmas playlist with you guys? These are just my top 10. There are more, but I will leave the playlist to all the songs in the description box below. So let's jump into the video with the very first song. These are not in order. These are just the 10 songs that are my favorite to listen to. So the very first song that I have on my list is Mariah Carey's All I Want For Christmas. I love the album, but I love that song specifically. Number two is my husband's new song, Ace Suck and the song is called Santa Claus I'm coming to you and he did he's been singing this song at least for 20 years and I finally told him you need to put this song down because I sing it all the time during the Christmas season and so do our kids and it's just that's a song that we're very familiar with but the world isn't so I told him to put it down finally and he released it just this season if you guys obviously it's in the playlist below if you guys want to check it out. Number three is Andy Williams, It's the Most Wonderful Time of the Year. I love that song. That song just gets me in the Christmas spirits and it just gives me all the holiday feels. Number four is George Michael, Last Christmas. That is a fun pop song and I know it's supposed to be like a sad song in a way, but I like it by him the most. And I know that um, I think Taylor Swift did it and I think Glee did it, but I like it by George Michael the most. Number five is Pentatonix, Mary Did You Know? It is a Christian song, which we love. My husband also sings it, you know, live and it's amazing. And if he has it on his, on his YouTube channel, I will also link it below, but I'm not sure if he has it, if he's ever recorded it, but it's one of my favorite songs, Christian songs around the holiday season. Michael English also did it. And he does a wonderful job on it, but I just wanted to show you the Pentatonix version in case you're not familiar with it. Number six is Kelly Clarkson's Underneath the Tree. She just released this album, I think a couple years ago, and it's slowly but surely becoming one of my favorites. She's got a lot of good songs in there, but Underneath the Tree is my favorite. Number seven is Frank Sinatra's Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas. I love the all the traditional, the classic songs, and Frank Sinatra is one of my favorites. Number eight is Nat King Cole's The Christmas Song, and I just learned that that is the name of that song. I always thought it was like chestnuts roasting on an open fire or something like that. Did not know that was the name of the song. Let me know in the comments below if you knew that was the name of that song. <laughs> Number nine is Michael Buble's version of It's Beginning to Look a Lot Like Christmas. Michael Buble is a crooner, kind of like um, Frank Sinatra, only he's in current times, and I really love that style, and I love the way he delivers that song, and I basically love him. All his songs, there are, uh, they are on point. And number 10 is Trans-Siberian Orchestra, Christmas Eve. That song is Oh, it just so it makes me so excited and so happy when I listen to that song. I become, you know, one of those director people myself. So yeah, I love that song. All right, you guys, I hope you take a listen to all the songs I have on the playlist. Again, let me know if you thought the name of Nat King Cole's Christmas song was Chestnuts Roasting on an Open Fire because that's what I thought. Remember to be entered in the giveaway. You have to like and comment every single video that I've uploaded during Vlogmas and you have to be subscribed to the channel. I will see you guys again in a brand new video tomorrow.